pay. Tell me how you came to get such a Roman name as that. Well, as I understand, I'm Cassius Marcellus Clay the Six, and my great-great-grandfather was a Kentucky slave, and he was named after some great Kentuckian. Well, Cassius Marcellus Clay is a great name in Kentucky. And uh, really, where he was from, or where it was all originated, I couldn't tell you, but since I've reached a little fame in boxing, most people want to know where I'm from, and. Uh, where did I get that name? But really, I haven't really checked on it, so I see that I'm going to have to go look in the You'll have to look it up. See what it's all about now that I'm getting a little interview. About a year before the Liston fight, Cassius was introduced to the Nation of Islam leader, the Honorable Elijah Muhammad, who then assigned Malcolm X to mentor the young Cassius. Cassius was told by promoters not to say anything about being affiliated with Malcolm X until the fight was over. Cash's feelings about doing this were about to boil over. I'm getting tired of talking. Is this going to call for a new contract uh, signing? I don't know what it's going to call. I'm just ready to fight, and I'm glad it'll be here where all these big mouth people here in Miami talking about I talk too much, and this one's going to whoop me. Well, I want all of them to be there. Imagine in the biggest moment of your life, you had to hide your race, your religion, your culture, your friends, everything you knew you had to hide. And then you win. It just pours out of your soul. And I just turned 22 years old. I must be the greatest. Now, I told the world, I talk to God every day. If God's with me, can't nobody be against me. I shook up the world. I shook up the world. I am the king of the world. Hold it, hold it, hold I'm it. Pretty. Hold it, you're not that pretty. I'm a bad man. Wait, wait. I shook up the world. I shook up the world. Uh, no, I shook Oscar. up the world. Cassius Clay is a name no more, is that right? Yes, sir. It's Muhammad Ali. Muhammad means worthy of all praises, and Ali means most high in the Asian African language. How long have you had the name? Well, for about um, two weeks now. There was anybody special gave you the name? Yes, sir. My leading teacher, the most honorable Elijah Muhammad. Why don't you like to be called Clay anymore? No, oh, Clay was not my name. Once we follow them, believe, hear the, understand the teachings of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad and come into knowledge of ourselves, then we want to be called after names of our people, which are names that fit us black people. And Clay was a white man's name. It was a slave name. And I'm no longer Clay. I'm no longer a slave. So now I'm Muhammad Ali. When he changed his name to Muhammad Ali, it created some truthful confusion in the black community. If I said it comes Mr. Chain Chong, you'd pitch your channel. <laughs> if I said it comes Mr. Khrushchev, you look for Russia. If I said it comes Mr. Goldberg, you look for Jew. If I said it comes Mr. White Cloud, you look for Indian. If I said it comes Mr. Castro, you look for Cuban. Here comes Mr. Lumumba, Mr. Kenyatta, you look for African, a black man. Now what's your last name? You know, it was one thing for white reporters to call him Clay, but when black opponents call him Clay, ooh. <laughs> no. Cassius Clay, yes. Why do you want to say Cassius Clay? You ain't got no money. Back off of me. Don't Back call off me of me. Uncle Tom. That's man. what you are, or Uncle Tom. Why are you going to call me Uncle Tom? What you going to do? You heard me? me Back Tom. off of me. And so, ladies and Uncle gentlemen. Tom? As the two contestants prepare for battle right, right, right now, back off of you, man! Back off of you, man! Another interview has been recorded for part two. And the two gentlemen continue. Uncle Tom! The steady, the humiliated. And he is screaming at him, watch my name, watch my name. Say my name. 